The Huntsville Police Department shared surveillance video with us that shows a woman who they say is Nance walking around. A family member of Nance, Frank Matthews, says that the family is not convinced that it's her in the video. He says it's too pixelated and shot from too far away to even recognize the person. The tape roll where they had her getting in the van, then the tape would have rolled where the officer found the shoes. Because the only part of the van they didn't show was the backside. Everything else you could see. So why did they stop the video? Why did they continue? To, if they talk about the shoes so much, why couldn't they have showed the media the officer finding the shoes? He says they have not received a copy of the video and they want to be given the full unedited surveillance footage of the person entering the van and being found in the van. He says the family was only shown parts of the video. Earlier this month, the Huntsville Police Department said that it was against department policy for the van to be unlocked. When I asked today if they had revised that policy, I was told that there was no update. The Madison County Coroner says that the State Department of Forensics has not completed the autopsy report. He expects that could take weeks, even months. Back to you, Nicole.